We're here with Coach Delroy Watt, fitness trainer with the men's national football team. Coach, it's uh, the day after our victory over Anguilla. Um, we are back here at training. Give me an idea as to what's been going on today. All right, Gavin. So today we're just having a recovery session following our victory, a free nil victory against Anguilla yesterday. So basically the session is just to get the players stretched, relaxed. We have some fun drills, some, some parcel drills, shooting drills, you know, just to loosen the players' muscles. We also did some stretching as well. Give me an idea as to the fitness levels of the team following the game against Anguilla. It was our first international game since March. All right, I feel the, the, fit, the players' fitness level, we, we, are, we are okay because the game, I wouldn't say it wasn't much demanding because we, 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 dominated, we dominated the game. Everybody could see that we had close to 80% possession in the in the game we didn't have any more any injuries per se so our players are fit and ready to go mm -hmm. and coach uh, in terms of the drills being done today um just elaborate a little bit on them okay so we have a circuit we have a small circuit here today where we have about three free station three stations rather we have a shooting one a station where we have shooting drills another where we have passing and another we are where we have a technical a technical station mm -hmm. overall impressed with the fitness level of the squad yes i'm very much impressed gavin when we when we started the the players were covering about in a game and so we, we were covering about eight eight peak, um, kilometers now we're covering uh, over 11 kilometers so we we can clearly see that the the players aerobic capacity has clearly improved what would you say um, has contributed to that increase in stamina from the team i would say clearly our the planning also we just want to commend the dfa for investing in the the gps devices and heart rate monitors where we have empirical data where we can look at how much distance the players are covering and and the speed at which the the players are covering that distance mm -hmm. and compare it to international level everything we do gabby is based on international standards. Mm -hmm. And looking forward to Barbados, um, you know, it's a, about a few days away. Uh, what are some of the things that you'll be doing? All right. So we'll be clearly practicing a lot of tactics, Gavin, because the, the, the tactical strategy that we're going to use for, against Barbados is not the same for Anguilla. So that is what, in the next coming days, that's what we're going to focus on, mm -hmm. on the, our tactical plan going into the Barbados game. All right. Thank you very much, Coach Watt, for your time. You're welcome.